The first puzzle that we present to you today is from the match between Lev Polugaevsky with the white pieces, against Shilagi with the black pieces, and the match was in the Moscow Championship in 1960. The move to white made a beautiful sacrifice bishop f8. Now if the black refuse the sacrifice and play king h5, they lose the match by one move, rook captures pawn checkmate. Therefore, the black is forced here to accept the sacrifice, so that the white continues his attack with the move rook d3, threatening to checkmate with the move rook h3, which is only defended by some comic moves from the search engine. Our second puzzle in today's episode of Ramnathan with white piece match against J. Uram Ashwin with black piece Chennai 2011, the move for black where he made a great sacrifice bishop f1, if white accepts it with the move bishop capturing bishop, he loses the match by either move rook h2, or queen h2. But if accepts sacrificing with the move rook captures bishop, he loses the match by the move queen captures bishop checkmate. As for the search engine, it prolongs the match a little, as usual, with the sacrifice of a queen than any negative move, so that the black win by the moves, bishop captures bishop check. Rook captures bishop. Queen capturing rook checkmate. The third puzzle in this video is from Franz Gutmeier's match with the white pieces and his opponents Widerski with the black pieces in the match played in 1928. The move to white where he played a beautiful sacrifice queen captures pawn check. Rook captures queen. Rook c8 check. Any of the rooks captured the rook checkmate. The fourth puzzle of the episode, from Ioannis Papa Ioannou's match with the white pieces against Kvainis with the black pieces, a match played by Plovdiv in 2003. And here there are two sacrifices, one that the search engine suggests, and one that Papa Ioannou played with the game, both of which are very impressive and creative. We start with the sacrifice of the search engine, which is the move rook 1 g6. If pawn captures rook, queen captures rook, now the threat is checkmate on the h7 square, whether the rook or the queen is not resolved. But if the black refuses to accept the sacrifice, and plays any other move, the white responds with a new sacrifice, rook captures h6 check. Of course if bishop captures rook, queen captures bishop checkmate. But if completes king capture rook here, the white continues rook h7 checks. King g8. Rook h8 check. King g7. Queen h7 checkmate. The sacrifice that occurred in the match is no less remarkable, as Papa Ioannou played here rook g5. If a black completes with pawn captures rook, he loses the match immediately by moving queen captures pawn checkmate. But if the black complete the match with the move, bishop captures rook. White continues the attack with the move, pawn captures bishop. King captures rook. Queen captures pawn check. King g8. Pawn capturing pawn, now no defense of the move queen g7 checkmate, only a miserable sacrifice to prolong the match one extra move and nothing more. Fifth episode puzzle of Vinley Kornfeldt's white piece match against Hickel black piece match, core match in 1964. A beautiful sacrifice made by the white, where he played knight f6, the purpose of which is to block the defense of the black from checkmate and it is also an attack the queen by revealing. Now if black responds with pawn captures knight, white wins the move, queen g7 checkmate. Let us now discuss more ideas here. For example, if the black decided to defend checkmate, with the move rook g8, he would lose his queen immediately and could not even capture the knight, otherwise he would lose the match by the following moves. Queen capture pawn check. Rook g7. Queen captures rook checkmate. But if he tried to complete the match with the move, Queen captures knight. White responds with rook captures queen, and the black cannot capture the rook, otherwise he loses the match immediately with the move queen g7 checkmate. Therefore, the black here have to defend the checkmate with the move rook g8, to lose the match with the following moves. Rook h6. If pawn captures rook. Queen d4 check. Rook g7. Queen captures rook checkmate. So the search engine here suggests the move rook c6, to lose the rook and the match is completed with the next moves, and the victory is settled. One last possibility before we study the search engine move, which is a rook captures knight. White wins by the following moves, queen captures rook check. Then two sacrifices do not prevent the inevitable fate.
Now the best move for the black is queen captures queen. White replies has a superb move, knight e8. The threat is now rook f8 checkmate. Now if, for example, he plays h6 to escape from the checkmate, he loses his queen and will be late with rook, and the white also has a sweeping attack. As for the search engine here, it proposes queen e6 move, to lose its queen as well, and the threat is still present. After h6, the white plays rook e7, the same format as before, with the same threat. The sixth puzzle today in the match that took place in 1956 in Leningrad between Korzov with the white pieces and Igor Blechtsin with the black pieces, so that the black ended the match with a beautiful sacrifice, bishop captures pawn, with an attack by revealing the queen of white, if the white completes the match with the move king captures bishop. Lose by moves queen captures queen. Rook captures queen. Rook captures rook. And victory is within the reach of the black. So the best complement to white here is queen captures queen. Black surprises his opponent with a great between move, knight e3 checkmate. King captures bishop. Knight captures rook. Queen captures knight. Rook captures queen. And now the black can win easily. The seventh puzzle is really cool and is the oldest puzzle of the day from 1892. The match is not known where it was played, and it is played between Wordsworth Donisthorpe with the white pieces and Mundell with the black pieces, where the white made a sacrifice that immediately wins all possibilities, the sacrifice is queen e5 check. If black responds f capture queen, he loses by the move bishop g5 checkmate. But if he plays d capture queen, he loses by the move bishop c5 checkmate. Of course if he plays bishop e6, he loses by the move queen captures bishop checkmate. The power of bishops should not be underestimated. The eighth puzzle of the episode of match Nigel D. Shorts with white piece, against Das Neil Opel by the black piece, at the 1999 United Inns Championship. Here is the move for the black and he is in a difficult situation, as the white will promote to a queen, which means that losing is a matter of time, so the black must strike now and win. And as we will see he has a great plan that he starts with offering a great sacrifice knight e3 check. If the white accepts the sacrifice by the move, bishop captures knight. Black wins the following moves. Queen b1 check. Bishop c1. Rook d2 check. As for if the white accepted the sacrifice by the move, rook captures knight. Black wins by the following moves. Queen f1 check. Rook e1. Queen f3 check. Rook e2. Queen captures rook checkmate. At the end of the video, we hope that you have liked it and that it has benefited you. Please do not forget to honor us by joining the channel, and to press the like button, as your support is what drives us forward.